Well, this regarding the film S. Durga, the Kerala High Court has uh, permitted Sanal Kumar's S. Durga to be screened at the Goa Film Festival. Well, uh, this is uh, against the decision, the last minute decision that was taken uh, by the ministry is what the filmmaker had said. The INB ministry had asked for the film to be dropped in the screening of the Goa Film Festival, which was launched just yesterday. Overruling that, this is a go-ahead now that has come in from the filmmaker from the Kerala High Court, permitting his film to be screened at the IFI Festival in Goa. And this after the director sought the intervention of the court last week. Against the Information and Broadcasting Ministry's order, the film was dropped from the final miss list suddenly, with no explanation here given to the filmmaker. Allegedly following the intervention of the INB Ministry is what the filmmaker had stated all along. The filmmaker who had slammed this move by calling it unprecedented interference in the screening of the film. The film festival jury chief Sujoy Ghosh had also quit the panel in protest. The film that had already been passed by the censor with the UNA certificate after they were asked to change the title. The original title was Sexy Durga, which was changed from S Durga, but it was still dropped last minute. This has come in as a huge victory as far as the filmmaker is concerned. With the Kerala High Court now giving the go-ahead, we have with us our correspondent Vivek with these inputs. Uh, Vivek, uh, one would look at this as remarkable. The High Court having overruled the ministry's decision, the festival is still underway and the filmmaker has a chance to screen his film. Absolutely true. This comes as a huge victory uh, for uh, director Sanal Kumar Shashidharan uh, and it's also coming as a setback for the INB ministry who, which has cancelled the permission uh, the panorama session uh, for this movie called S. Durga, uh, which was earlier certified, uh, you know, by the CBFC. Now, the Kerala High Court has uh, critically said that, you know, the certified version of S. Durga uh, can be, uh, uh, you know, screened at the uh, Goa Film Festival. And uh, this comes after, you know, uh, Sanal Kumar Shashidharan uh, reaching the Kerala High Court, uh, you know, in, with a complaint that, you know, his uh, permission, his movie was... Uh, uh, denied permission without any reason. He also slammed uh, the INB ministry's decision last week, clearly saying that, you know, it's a very autocratic decision and uh, uh, it is also an infringement on uh, the freedom of expression. And uh, and this was even supported by all the directors uh, uh, from the Kerala film industry. They also uh, met the chief minister on this regard. There was also a signature campaign. So everything coming to a positive note now. Now, yes, uh, S. Durga will be allowed to screen in the film festival. We try to reach Sanil Kumar Shashtaran, but he's out of range. Uh, we don't know where is he exactly uh, to get his reaction. Uh, but yes, he has also tweeted on the Very on quickly, very also wanting to understand what this means on ground. It is a film festival uh, which is being also handled by the INB ministry. Uh, one would think that they've been roughed up in this manner, despite the go-ahead from the Kerala High Court on ground, how smooth is the process going to be to eventually have S. Durga screened in the film festival? Yes, uh, now uh, with the Kerala High Court's intervention now, there won't be any much hurdle for this uh, for, for the film to be screened. Now, yes, the INB ministry has not reacted on this now. Uh, yes, the INB ministry can also oppose this decision in the High Court and also challenge this order. Uh, but... Uh, uh, but we are still now they haven't reacted on this. But yes, as for now, uh, what we understand is from the film uh, fraternity is that you know the film won't be facing much hurdle. It will be, it can be uh, screened in the film festival without any issues. Vivek, many thanks for getting us those inputs. Uh, of course, uh, Vivek quickly also going to be getting our viewers the first reaction of the filmmaker on this uh, go ahead now, which has come in from the Kerala High Court. He is allowed to go ahead and screen his film, uh, saying that uh, the INB ministry unjustifiably had blocked it at the IFI festival in Goa.